high school, I was really drawn to theater because you could be a very big person, but you would be couched behind a character. But what I then decided is that I would take on the experience of being a playwright, and suddenly the experience reversed, and I had the opportunity to see my words, but spoken by somebody else, which was exhilarating, but it's also completely terrifying because suddenly you're vulnerable in a completely new way. I had taken a really exceptional English class with a professor who was very interested in mythology and feminism. I explored Sondheim's Into the Woods and was looking at the way fairy tales are reimagined in that play. It was an opportunity for me to really see how a, a music theater piece can explore this older material and innovate with it and introduce new themes. So when I decided to propose my thesis, I began looking at mythology that was closely linked to, to my own family. And so my father is Welsh and was really interested in telling me little snippets of folk tales as bedtime stories. I found a female protagonist who was really interesting to me. So this was Rhiannon and she's a very outspoken female character. She read as incredibly modern and was surprising to find that in a mythological tale. I was really interested in bringing forward her voice from the mythology. In the same way that Sondheim takes the fairy tales and creates something of his own. The really exciting thing about the Lewis Center, the entire theater season is almost entirely um, created around senior thesis projects. And so you get to work with so many incredible collaborators and most of them are students. So I had a student director working on the project and a student lighting designer and a wonderful team of student musicians and actors. And I had the opportunity to travel to Wales to really research and visit the places where the mythology takes place. The idea of that was to bring the folk music of Wales, to bring the storytelling tradition that's currently alive in Wales into the theatre because we're creating a show in a black box in New Jersey. But I wanted to make sure that the story was rooted in the place that it came from. So next year I have the extraordinary opportunity to continue studying contemporary storytelling performances and revivals of mythology in Wales. And so I'm hoping to continue revising Rhiannon and to create new work based on mythology and looking at how mythology can be used to address contemporary issues of feminism, environmentalism. And I think at so many other schools, you're working with pre-existing repertoire. You, as a thesis student, you very much create something and are given the opportunity to, to run with this dream project. They give you the resources to do so and I just felt really excited and proud of what we had made and sad to see it go, but also just very grateful for the opportunity to have made something with such an extraordinary group of people and with such fantastic mentors behind us and supporting us.